20 cars by 2022, which is insane. Man, I'm so tired. Oh. Well, good morning, everybody. You joined James and I. Oh my voice. You can tell by the yeah. sounds of things, it's early. It's very <laughs> early. It's about 10 past six in the morning. We are in the 540C right now with Sam in front in the 570 GT because today we're driving back to England, aren't we? we yeah, in one hit. I don't know. I've never done it. What, in one go. That? No? Well, no. There's today a blog for you. Yeah. <laughs> so, Monaco to London in one day with two McLarens. Let's hit it. Yeah. <laughs> Here's the setup. I am currently editing away. Whilst we have Sam in front in the 570 GT. We are cruising just as the sun's coming up. So, I, Josh and I have always said that at this time, the only people who are up on a Sunday morning are people who are clubbing and bakers. And now YouTubers. And now YouTubers. Here we are. We are. I think we work. What? Well, I think we worked out. It's like it's it's over 600 miles just to Calais. Yeah. And then we've got to go up to Woking to, yeah, drop, to, to drop, drop these, these cars off. back off at McLaren. Yeah. Of which time it's going to be like 12 at night. Yeah. And we don't know how we're going to get to where we're going. Then go. we need <laughs> to get home. Basically. Yeah, I think McLaren have kindly arranged transfers for us somewhere. Okay, good. But still. But still. This will take a while. It's gonna be a long day. We shall sleep it's in those It's gonna chapters. be a long day. I thought whilst I'm here, I might as well also show you the interior spec of this 540C because it's pretty special, isn't it? Well, it's one of the best I've been in, actually. Yeah. Just little details, like a Alcantara steering wheel. Yeah, it makes a big difference. It That's does. actually so nice compared it's to when you're driving right. the GT when you get in this, as the first thing you notice. It's obviously got the full carbon pack and then this red leather which is uh, really nice and I think it looks fantastic on the seats and the Bowers and Wilkins like, Bowers and not Wilkins only does it sound, sound epic good. it looks beautiful sunk in there yeah it looks really so much nice. sculpture on this they've done a yeah. really good job because the interior of this feels like it should be from a concept car yeah but they've managed to pull it off in a production car which is awesome it's really impressive yeah I mean there's Alcantara Alcantara on the seats as well we're using that rear shelf for our bags. There's a vast plethora of Alcantara in There this is, car. there <laughs> is indeed. And of carbon fiber all the way down there. On the exterior, it doesn't have that much carbon, this one. No, but it makes up for it by being in this like really metallic red. Yeah, it really, looks, really When the sun's nice out, color. this red looks so good. Yeah, and it's very cool to be in here because it's just, it, it feels with these bright colors all over the place on the interior and exterior, it makes you feel like you're in a proper supercar, which you are. A swap then I am at the wheel now and uh, you are you are in full YouTube we're, upload mode we're twin uploading because your laptops in by my feet is yeah the foot well I'm Mine's doing on my lap. photograph uploading we're hot spotting off my phone which thank the gods of signal that has just dropped onto 4G 4G so you should be able to upload your video so, quickly well, I say quickly, it says two hours and 22 minutes remaining. However, this is a long video. This is like 18 minutes long. Okay, yeah. Which is, yeah, it's and quite And once big. that's done, then you're, we're good. Then I we're good. To exactly. edit my we're video and upload that video afterwards. So yeah. the next driver swap, I'm just going to plug myself in and edit. Edit. Yeah. And then we're all idea. good to go. Then we can just, uh, oh, we've only got another 500 miles left. Oh, until, that's just, until that's just we to get Calais, to Calais, Calais yeah. yeah. <laughs> then we've got... <laughs> The Euro Tunnel, and we have to get all the way to Woking. Good times. But this uh, this car's fantastic for these sorts of trips, isn't it? It is mega. I'm so I'm so impressed with this little thing. Yeah, I say little so thing. Cool. It is a weapon. It is a total. Well, we were just talking about cars that you would have considered a total weapon and something yeah. that would not be outdone in a long time. Uh, a few years ago, something like a Scud. Yeah. Now this thing just puts yeah. it to shame. We were talking about even. Hurricanes. Yeah, it wouldn't. I mean, it, it wouldn't know which yeah. way this thing went. Yeah, certainly a straight line. Oh yeah, this so this is listing. so fast. Yeah. This car. Yeah. yeah. Um, so it's fantastic it. to be able it. for these sorts of trips. It's perfect. Yeah. And I know, we, I know we're like packed to the roof, but I've got a massive bag in the in the 
boots. I mean, we've been on the road for three weeks. Yeah. So I've got the bag that I started with Alfa Romeo ice driving in the front. It's still there. It's, it's st- so I got three weeks worth of coats. Massive coats. Coat. Massive coat. I've got two massive coats. I've got the one McLaren gave me and the one Galak gave me. Yeah. In the front. Yeah. We have a, a whole car sheet yeah. for this, which is a big, yeah, big sack. Yeah, we've got a huge case for that. All of yeah. this, all of that in there. It's You've crazy. Got two bags. I've got one bag. Anyway, it's more practical than it looks, despite it being a small car. And the seats are very comfortable. Seats are comfortable. Heated seats, great sound system. I'm it's enjoying this. Absolutely enjoying perfect this. for what we're doing. And one thing I wanted to talk to you about, which we were just talking about, is uh, McLaren as a brand. And uh, I spoke to Josh about it, about how far they've come as a brand in such a short amount of time, but also how many new cars they're thinking of releasing. Yeah. So you told me. So they've got uh, this plan called. I hope this isn't too shaky. Well, too late now because we've been chatting for two and a half minutes. How about yeah. like, if I do that for you? Yeah, they've got this. I mean, I heard about this a while ago, so if my figures are wrong, yeah. I'm sorry. But as a general overview, rather than getting into specifics, they have a business plan. Um, I think it's called Track 22. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 20, 22. And they're planning on launching like 20 cars by 2022. Which is insane. Which is For huge. For a car make, I mean, so many It cars. is huge. And it's not that they're going to be launching 20 new platforms. That'll be split across various. Yeah, of different so, platforms. you know, with, with them doing 720, for example, that they'll probably do 720S, 720 Spider, 720LT, and then LT they'll probably Spider. throw it, yeah, LT Spider, and then they'll throw in some of the things like the HS, yeah. things like that. The Mars Edition. Exactly. Yeah. They've got, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm sure, 570 Spiders in yeah. the works, and various other cars. Uh, there's been, you know, uh, news from them about this BP23 project, which is a yeah. three, three, three seater. seater coming soon. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's not like there's going to be entirely new cars, there's going to be variants of them, oh, the but still cars, yeah. it's going to be great to see that much fresh content <laughs> coming out, hitting yeah. our roads. It, it's sort of a bit of a Porsche approach, isn't it? It so is, yeah. Porsche have Targas, they have GT3s. Yeah, yeah. Is that working? Okay, so we'll, it's we'll make this work. not too long. Yeah, sorry if it feels weird that my arm's like in the thing, yeah. but if I let go, Anyway, anyway, um, yeah. yeah. So it's, it is sort of a Porsche approach to things. Yeah, um, which it is seems to work well for them. It works fantastic for them. And then there are cars that we didn't expect, like the GT, uh, the 570 yeah, GT. I wouldn't have GT. thought that before. Yeah, before so there yeah. might be new cars like that coming out, yeah. which we don't know about. So, exactly. um, so no, it's an exciting time for the brand, and we both absolutely love this brand. So oh, wait, wait, wait. to be able to see it growing so quickly is yeah. fantastic for us. I mean, you like it so much, you bought one. Indeed, I did. Two now. Two. Yes. Two. Two. So, and hopefully many more to come. Hopefully so. And hopefully one day I'll join you. Absolutely. The McLaren Club. Would it be splendid? It would be lovely. <laughs> Doesn't this feel like Gumball again? All over again. We're eating terrible food. We're hardly sleeping. We're editing on the go. We're editing on the go. We're filming on the go. We're driving ludicrously long hours. Long distances. But at least tomorrow we're not getting up and doing it all over again. That's true. Tomorrow we can lie in and relax because, and also we're in a much nicer car. We yeah, were that on too. <laughs> so it does make a difference. Nothing it's much more the Lotus, but yeah. it almost killed me. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> so this is this is much nicer. I'm actually having some back pain, lower, lower, lower back, back issues, pain, which I don't think is down to these seats. It may be, but I've been getting this more and more on road trips, which is worrying because. Do you know what? We do a lot oddly, of oddly enough, the track pack that comes with uh, like carbon yeah, buckets. Yeah, the LT seats. The they're LT actually, I find them a more supportive seat, a more comfortable seat. Just well, that's like what I was saying, the Exige. The carbon yeah. seats that are now in the 380 are actually more comfortable yeah. and more supportive. So they they just hold you in the right places and in the right driving position. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you have an, a video to edit. I have a it's lot the, yeah. of editing to do, yeah. yeah. But it's nice when we're in the car together, we discuss, you know, titles, thumbnails, yeah. edits, yes. and all this stuff, so it's kind of fun editing sure, the car man. together. Yeah, it's a good time. And we've got this new contraption. Literally this the best. It's just saved my saves life, basically. our lives. Yeah. I know this <laughs> it's the small things. Yeah. The most ridiculous thing, but it's basically an a in-car MacBook charger. Yeah. And I know that sounds ridiculous, but I used to carry around with me, a plug that would like 
Yeah, yeah. It was like, it the was like a box yeah. this big and it had your conventional British plug socket in there. Yeah. I used to plug in my own plug thing, but this goes straight in in the 12 volts. You just leave it in your car. And it's, and it's, yeah. Because so usually it's, I would just charge up and then when I was out of battery, I was I'd like, like oh, that's I need it. to edit. Game over. To edit yeah. Later, yeah, I know, right? Whereas now you can just keep going on the whole drive. So, so. productive. Give it a little bit. Give it some gas. Oh, this thing's so sick. Now that's my kind of gearbox. Yeah, this gearbox. I was I've saying earlier, I am such it. a gearbox snob. Yeah. So for me, it's either super sophisticated twin clutch gearbox or manual. Or manual. If yeah. it's in between single clutch, any of that nonsense, you do not like. I just don't even put me in it. Yeah. See, I like violent gearboxes. So I like you the love way it punches you. you I like that. I like the Aventador gearbox. Do actually. You? Wow. I mean, I like it for when you're on it. I don't like it for around town. This is the thing. Uh, you know, when you're when you're when you're Cruising driving around. conventional, doing this really quick. But not fast enough so that the the gearbox is ramping up to a hundred percent. It's just. Shall we fill up again? Sloppy. We've got half a tank. Yeah, I think so. Might as well. Oh, that's a yeah, do your camera. <laughs> so I'm officially the worst co-driver of all time. You're officially the worst co-driver of all time. So you I just told me you. I slept for six hours. I literally haven't seen you. We've been driving past the car and it just looked like it's been James. Oh, I've just got fuel left all low. That's good. Uh, yeah. By himself because you just sunk into the footwell. Oh, I feel so bad for James. <laughs> <laughs> How are you doing though? Because you've been I'm driving dying. the whole way. I'm dying. Really? Oh, mate. I'm so... Over. I love this car, but I'm so over it. So over it. You just want to get there now. <laughs> just yeah. want to get there. But we're nearly at the Eurotunnel. You can have a rest there. Whoop, whoop. Eurotunnel, we're here. We made it. So what was that? Six oh, wait, wait, wait. till... We set, we set off at six. This morning. And it's yeah. now 6.20. So that was 12 hours and 23 minutes. Flat on the road. Yeah, non-stop. 12 hours 20. You could fly to LA in that time. Wow. And we only made it up to Monaco. Up to Canada. Monaco to yeah. <laughs> We're through. It's we are we, through. It's how we, roll. we just move up here. So apparently Flexi Plus. Flexi Plus. Have we ever done Flexi Plus? Uh, I can't say I have actually. Normally just buck a time and jump on. Okay. So, uh, this means you can go whenever you so choose. You can go whenever As you and like. When you please. As it happens, we want to go right now. Yeah. <laughs> we're, we're not even stopping. We're just going. Yeah. My voice. <laughs> you're just crazy. What's going on with my voice? Sounds like me at the end of Gumball last year. Oh. I hope you're not coming down with something, man. Mate, imagine if not uh, scare you, you were in the hospital. Yeah. Ride height up. You, ah, there's something I don't like about this car. Mm. How you put the lift up. You have to hold. Yeah, I wish it was just a button. That's an improvement on the LT. Yeah, which was like, you had to go First of all, the LT, you have to hold up the stalk, then it goes beep. How's that steady cam working out for you? Yeah, real good, mate. <laughs> hold up the stalk, it goes beep, then you let it go, and then you tap it up again, and it raises up. And because it's four-wheel lift rather than just front lift... It takes ages. Ages. But they're loving the bumps on this road. I really Ooh. love it. Here's another one. Send it. Oh. And the lights up. Yeah, lights up. perfect. Made it onto the, as you just called it, channel. The channel, the channel. Look how close they make you park. That makes me quite uncomfortable. How close? Do you, you remember are. what happened the last time we were on the channel tunnel together? Together, together. you were that, sick everywhere. That was the last time I was here. In fact, the last time. Really? I, yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I I went on it to go that way to go back to France when I did the trip down to Geneva. Geneva, but not this way. The last time I went this way. I was passed out on the floor. On the floor. And they had to make an announcement on the whole train. To get a doctor. To get a doctor to me. That was and actually was, genuinely very scary. It was pretty bad. I was hyperventilating so much, my, my hands locked up like this. Yeah. And I was walking around like a crab. Yeah. yeah True yeah, story. Yeah. <laughs> like, it that was, was bad. the worst day of my life. That was really bad. Yeah. Well, hopefully time. that won't happen again. Yeah, man. Although I am starting to not feel great. I think maybe from exhaustion, but I my think voice is. Burning the candle at both ends. Is the saying how the saying goes? <laughs> what does the saying mean? The saying means you've been smashing it in the day and smashing it in the night, and you're just worn out. Yeah. Waking up at six o'clock to go to do here. Yeah. Getting in it. Yeah. Getting in at three a.m. to get yeah. up at six a.m. and filming and editing and going out and rinse and repeat. <coughs> yeah. Dead. That. Yeah. <laughs> so this is happening, but we're on the tunnel. Long drive, 13 hours, uh, and now we've got about two and a half hours left to MTC McLaren Technology Center. Wow! How are we doing? 
Oh, man, I'm so tired. I'm good. I'm good though. I'm good. You know what? It hasn't actually been that bad. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like we smashed it. Yeah, the a couple of grim moments. Of it this morning was horrific. Horrific. Yeah. Thinking 12 hours on the other side of France. Yeah. Sounded just so depressing. Yeah. And now we're sat on the Channel Tunnel. Yeah. It was all right. In the grand scheme of things. And the weather's been good. Weather's been great. And apart the from the Paris, apart from the Paris incident, which you were asleep for. Uh, so what happened in Paris? We went on that. Well, you remember Where when we went to get is? the McGann? Yeah. On that road, you went. This is always the worst road. Never come on this road. Oh yeah. yeah. For some reason, my waist decided to take me on that road. Yeah, now we're all in. What about that oh, van? Yeah, that van who was g giving a, a bit of hassle. Yeah, like, he was nuts. Nuts. Yeah. There were a few nuts. Nuts. Oh. Van. I know, right? Pushing us all over the road. I'm leaving. Crazy You're like, no, right? on the road trip. Yeah, mate. We're wearing matching jumpers. <sighs> yeah, I, I only clocked that a minute ago when yeah. you were pointing it. It's honest to God, though. In real life, they're quite different, but on that screen, they look they look very similar. identical. Our train will be arriving shortly. Sam has very kindly made me a mini little slide. We've decided we're gonna go grab some dinner. I'm staying at Arches tonight, so we're gonna go to Nando's before heading back to McLaren Technology Center. So that's gonna be happening, and yeah, basically that's the, the only update. I got for you, we're exhausted. We're gonna be back in England, which will be lovely. This is going to be home for the next two hours. Apparently, the M25 at this time, which is a main motorway, in England, around London, is really, really bad. So hopefully we're not going to get stuck in too much traffic because that's all we need to make this trip a lot longer. Exiting now. Finally, it's, God, it's dark out here. Wow, God, it really is dark. And quite a bit colder according to uh, to the vehicle. We made it. we just driven. How long has it been door to door? 14 hours? 14 hours. 14 and then hours. look who's here. Monaco to I Woking. Flew. This guy flew. <laughs> I mean, that's crazy that you're here. We saw you this morning in Monaco, and now you're here. With my car. With your beautiful A45, which we know very well. Anyways, the McLaren, I've just gotten all my stuff out of it. We're going to get a cheeky now. Nando's right now. And I'm going to drop the McLaren off. You're dropping it off. And I'm going to head back to Archie. So, listen. High five. We Dude, nailed it. Thanks for doing a lot of the driving. Oh, mate, I slept for slept half of it. Really? Half the yeah. I was just there like... He good chat. He yeah. Good chat. Yeah. Oh, I can <laughs> sleep. All right, so let's go get Nando's and then we'll end this later at yours. Yeah. Let's anyway, get home safe, mate. Thanks for everything. Hey, yo. Quick cap saving, Saturday in the mall. Snow Julie.